Hello everyone, I am now in the entrance to Punta Chame. I am on my way to Playa Caracol. I just turned a left from the Pan American Road and now I have to drive about 15 to 18 kilometers from the Pan American Road until to arrive to Playa Caracol in Punta Chame. So I will show you the road um, and then we're gonna have some videos there. Uh, Playa Caracol, I'm gonna show you the beach and then you will also see the nice uh, surf spot that you're gonna find it there in Playa Caracol. Um, let's follow me and let's enjoy this together. Now I am in, a, in the public area, uh, Playa Caracol, so here you can come, even if you don't have a resident here, you can come to enjoy the beach, also to surf, and if you just want to stay relaxed at the beach, you can come in, and if you want to eat here, so here is a nice restaurant where you can come in and order uh, really good food. So you are welcome always to come here and try a new experience here at Playa Caracol and the public area. So now here inside in the restaurant that you're gonna find here in the public area at Playa Caracol, I'm going to show you a little bit of how this nice place looks like. Nice music. Let's go to see the menu. Hola. Now I am here trying to protect from the sun. That is quite hot now, it's midday on the uh, ranchito. So here you can rent the ranchito and you can also rent your some uh, shirt that you can sit in there to get tan. So now we're going to the beach. So let's see the nice surf spot that you wanna see here. It's really nice, really, really nice. There are the surfers. Really amazing. I like a lot the color of the sand, it's so white. Let's go to walk a little bit here on the beach. really nice many families here playing on, on the beach take the song enjoying with their kids surfing with the pets as well it's really nice here It's a really long beach. It's mostly like a, a little bit more than one kilometer of beach. So a lot of fun definitely here. It's a little bit crowded today because it's a day off here in Panama. So a lot of family come to the beach usually when it's a day off. It's Monday now, but we are a day off for a Panamanian celebration. Tomorrow, Tuesday, we have to go back to work, but the people are enjoying this beautiful summer day.
we are now inside the village and this is a village with two bedrooms in this area this is the living room and dining room that you have here is an open space here you're gonna have what is the kitchen is the, the sensation the feeling here is the, that the apartment or the village is quite bright so it's a lot of lights here inside even when it's no lights just ready installed in the unit but i i feel bright because there's just the ocean 10 meters from here so basically this is the terrace of the village and there is the ocean a couple of steps and you're gonna be there on the beach so this is the laundry area the laundry area. This is a village that is now just in the finishing finishings level, so it's gonna be probably 100% done. All those red marks on the walls mean that they need to fix something, but little details, no big things to be fixed. This is a bathroom for the secondary bedroom. Um, this is the secondary bedroom. You have a window, it could be also a door because it's from floor to ceiling. Um, you can get access uh, directly to the job of the village here. Um, this is the completely secondary bedroom with a closet. You have it here. And then we go into the master bedroom. This master bedroom have a space for a double bed, have a closet area here. And here you have a direct access to the swimming pool area. And when you are in the swimming pool, I, I would say again, that it's quite easy to go to the beach. It's just in front, pretty nice. Let's go to the swimming pool and let's go to the beach. It's just amazing when you are here at the village residence, how close is from the beach. If you see behind me, there is a lot of sulfur now in the water. A lot of them, it's a really nice and beautiful sunny day. No cloudy at all. So, and there you see in my back, you're gonna see the village residence, the swimming pool, I am basically already stung uh, at the beach. So it's really, really, really nice here. Quite easy to come into the beach. It's basically there behind me. I am already here at the beach. I am standing on the sand already. This is the swimming pool here, uh, the village resident. This is not the only one. It's already three swimming pools here. All of them facing the ocean. If you see here, it is a swimming pool and you can see the ocean there. So it's really convenient because it's quite close from the beach. Basically you are already on the beach. I like the sensation to be here on the, on the pool and I still can see the ocean. It's not an infinity pool, but it's quite easy to have a similar, a similar feeling when you are here. Around the swimming pool, each of all the three that I saw, you're gonna have here the buildings around. Basically, each of those has four units, two in the ground floor and two up in the second one or in the first one. As they are low, low building, they don't have a elevator, but they have a stairs that is quite easy and simple to go up. I am now inside Playa Caracol. Um, the building that you can see behind me is the part of the project that the name is Aires del Mar. Um, Aires del Mar is basically many towers that's gonna be one next to each other and they, they share a social area with swimming pool and another amenities that I will show you. So let's go inside and you're gonna see all that you can enjoy when you are here in Aires del Mar. 
this is the view from outside the building so basically you want to see here a group of different towers all of them are part of Aires del Mar this is the area of parking basically here in Aires del Mar you don't have a parking with roof so you left your car here as you see here are many cars of all the owner of this nice project so we are now at Punta Chame it's a really nice and good sunny day we are next to the entrance of the project here you can see the security station with the check control so basically everybody have to do a registration there to come in inside the project here we have an elevator we're going to visit one unit in the first floor so let's take the stairs This is 59 square meter. This is the living room. And this is the view from this apartment. Basically, more or less, this is the view that all the units going to have when they are facing this part of the project because here is also other, other units that have a view to the social area. This is the area of the kitchen. It's an open space. And here you have a laundry area as well. Now you have here two bedrooms. You can appreciate the space. Basically you can put here inside a bunk bed and a single bed at the same time. There is a window there this is the master bedroom it's a double bed here it's a closet as well windows let's see the view from here so you can see here the view You are now in front of the sport area. You can see the basketball square and the tennis, uh, mini soccer square. So some of the amenities that the project offer to the residents. There's one toilet. There is the uni, uni bathroom that have the this size of unit at Aires del Mar, 59 square meters. Here at Aires del Mar, basically you're gonna have eight apartments per floor. You're gonna find a four, ap four apartments that are facing one side of the building and another four that are facing the area in front of the social area, the swimming pool and all that. We're going now to the swimming pool. You can see it from here. So basically four apartments going to face in the swimming pool area with a mountain view and the another one going to face in the uh, more like a uh, the security area and the and the parking sp parking space as well facing the direction of the ocean. Now we're going to the social area here at Playa Caracol. I'm gonna show you how is the swimming pool area here at Aires del Mar because this is the, just the social area for Aires del Mar. This is not for the whole Playa Caracol project. This is just for the area that is Playa Aires del Mar. So basically you're gonna find this swimming pool here. There's a nice swimming pool. Area. You can feel the breeze from the from the moon 
behind. Yeah, at the back. All that is a mountain area. It's really, really nice. This is the barbecue area that you're gonna, you're gonna have here. At Ida Zelma, more swimming pool. This is the barbecue area here. Sunny day. Those apartments here on the ground floor have the advance so that they have a terrace so you can enjoy a really nice and beautiful terrace here. Pretty convenient. Basically here outside we have Aires del Mar 1, 2, 3 and 4. So basically all these four buildings are completely sold. But here in this end space that we're gonna see here, soon we'll start the construction of Aires del Mar 5 and Aires del Mar seats. So, and after those two towers, here at the back, we're going to have the other side of the map. So, if you are not yet here in this project, side of the map, so don't be worried because still you have time to buy your unit. All this empty lot in the future is going to be Iris del Mar 5 and Iris del Mar 6. It's going to be towers similar to the tower that we have seen. Four floors, two elevators, eight apartments per floor. Four units are going to be facing this side with a mountain view and, and the social area view. And four units are going to be facing this side. to you. We are now in Aires del Mar. So let's keep visiting this project Playa Caracol. I want to show you now how the apartments look inside Ventanas del Mar. So let's follow me because now I'm going to show you how the apartments are from the inside. Here we have the entrance, the main entrance of Ventanas del Mar. Here we are inside, we have a panel here in this level, but we have the elevator, we're going now to the eighth floor. Here is the unit that we're going to visit. Uh, we will see how the apartment looks like from inside. Now I am entering in one apartment at Ventanas del Mar number three. And the purpose of this, to visit this unit, is just to show you the finishing of the details of the apartment because in the building number four that is under construction, there is going to be eight different models. Um, so the layout is not going to be exactly the same that we are seeing now, but the finishing will be. Now I am at the balcony of this unit in an eighth floor, and I am just surprised how amazing is the view. I can see basically the whole beach, I can see the surface there, the surface here in front, the swimming pool here. It's, it's just a wonderful view. I can see basically the whole bay. I can see Coronado far away, but I still I can see it. I can see the whole, the whole beach. It's just amazing. And here, in that space that I showed in the beginning of this video, is where the developer will build uh, Ventanas del Mar number four, which is gonna have eight different models. 
that you can pick up the one layout that is more convenient for you. So these units in particular, the owner, what they do is convert the unit uh, like a, an investment unit because they took this bedroom and they make it a kitchen in this one in order that they can, and they also make a door here so they can separate this from the main apartment and this is gonna be an area that they can rent and still they can use it in the other area of the apartment. So here is a one double bed with view to the ocean directly in the window, a TV here, a ceiling fan, an air conditioner. They make the, the kitchen here, they put in a little freezer, and this unit also have their own bathroom, so it's completely independent. So that's like a for investment, you still have the closet and all that, so they can rent to this, this unit, like a, it's something separately from the main apartment. But basically this unit is two bedroom. So we have here the kitchen, of the main area of the apartment is an open kitchen. Here we have the laundry area. And then we have what is, what we could call the master bedroom. from this building is amazing. Many owners here, if they are not living in Panama, what they do is that they buy their unit and then they put it for rent during the time that they are not using the unit. Many owners, they come in from United States or so what they do is that they live here during the Panamanian summer that basically is from December March and at the same time it's the winter in US so they avoid the winter in US and they come into this amazing weather with this spectacular beach to enjoy it. This is a place that many many foreigners from US and from Europe decide to use it like a vacation place or for play the, the, when they want to retire so because it's really comfortable it's safe and have a lot of amenity that just make your life really good and and it's easy to come in here during the whole year so many people love this project now i'm going to the backyard sanctuary because i want to see the beach from there how far it's from the street but it's not really far it's like a basically one minute one minute walking and i am already on the beach so i am now at the beach so i will go here basically now i am in the back for all those coming directly from the beach the apartments on the ground floor they have uh, the optional 
from the back because I'm coming down from the side of the beach um, so we're going into from the beach this is not the main entrance I will show you later what is the main entrance so we are here we're gonna catch the elevator and we're going to that apartment here now I will show the front of the building as we start from the back side because I went directly to show you how far is the beach and the back side of the building from the roof. So now this is the main entrance and after you pass that you're gonna be in the house that I show you that have the elevators.